Good morning, you guys, and welcome back to the channel. My name is McKenna, but I feel like if you're here, you already know that because that's the name of my page. So I say that every time. This morning, we just went to Starbucks. I got a medicine ball tea because I have been under the weather, I kid you not, for like the last month. I feel like I've been sick since Thanksgiving. I don't know if it's like sickness after sickness after sickness or if it's one long sickness that just won't go away. But my cough has gotten so bad that yesterday I went to the doctor and they put me on antibiotics. I was kind of trying to avoid that because I'm pregnant. I didn't want to be put on antibiotics, but if I didn't have to, but it's like getting so bad. It's like I'm coughing all night. So anyways, I got this hopefully to soothe my throat and today is going to be hope you can hear me over Leela. she's right here by my feet but um Poppy. i started organizing my closet and packing things up over like vlogmas today we're going to go through Leela's clothes because she has so many clothes and i'm going to sort them out into ages cause something Poppy. i've been meaning to do her whole life she's like oh. over a year and a half now also like just go through pr get rid of things oh. donate things so and I, I think our kitchen pots and pans so kind of like organization but i'm trying to slowly like declutter and get rid of things before we move so i want to do that but i do have a little bit of work to get done when i get a chance leela and i have been just down here on the ground playing if she'll give me a chance I'm, i've got some work to get done for brand deals i have one i have to come up with a caption for and then two two videos that need to be posted one today and then one later this week Luckily they're already filmed. And then I have a few UGC videos like I always do. And I, my hair is like day six hair. So I really need to wash it at some point. I'll probably wash it tonight. I feel like it's so much easier to wash it at night when Leela's in bed than earlier in the day. Welcome back to the channel. My new year's goal is to post once a week, but I'm scared to say that because <laughs> it may not happen. It's always scary to say things if you can't keep up on it. But my goal is to post every Sunday on YouTube for this year. Hopefully it was in focus that whole time. Okay, I just have a few emails from my management that I need to get back to. Okay, well this is my mess of an office. This has gotten like so out of hand. This is our recording area for the podcast, which Cassie and I have been a little bit behind on. I think I might record a couple solo episodes. Lila was just playing in this mirror, but she left. <laughs> Lila. Anyways, so I'm going to start selling things before we move to. I'm going to sell this mirror if I can. I have two other big mirrors like this that I'm going to try and get rid of because when we move, we're going to get the anthropology like big mirror. So we don't need to take big mirrors with us because honestly, they'll probably break during the move. I feel like I just sound so sick. I was going to go to Shred 415 today for the noon class. I don't even know what time it is and go work out, but I just am feeling worse than I did yesterday. I feel like really bad today. And I think you can hear it in my voice kind of. So I might just take a spin class in the basement and take it really easy so I don't have like a cough attack or anything. <sighs> but I've just been in here. I've been writing in the, whoa, in the five minute journal. I need to clean my office for one, but I've been writing in the five minute journal. And then I've been using my, I just picked this up from, where did I get this from? From Ross. So I got, it was funny, I had a Ross gift card. And so I went and I was like, gonna go look in the craft area. Oh, you can see it right there. It's 13 bucks at Ross and it's just the day design planner. You can get them at Target. Um, and I was like, I think at Target they're way more. So I thought that was a good deal. So I picked that up and my gift card was 15. So it was like perfect for that. Anyways, so I'm trying to prep for my wedding. I have a wedding on Friday, today it's Wednesday. So I'm prepping for my wedding, getting everything printed out that I need to take the timeline and stuff like that. And then charging all my batteries, getting everything packed so that that's ready to go and I don't have to stress about it tomorrow. I can just do like last minute things tomorrow to prep for it and then Friday all day. It's a 10 hour wedding, so it's gonna be a long day. I'm trying to build up the motivation to go take Leela outside and go on a walk to the park or something. So I need to bundle her up. It's pretty cold outside. It's very deceiving because it looks super warm, but it's not. <laughs> She loves seeing herself in the mirror. <laughs> I just went on like a 45 minute walk while Joey's watching Leela and uh, I'm gonna finish off the walk with stretching right here. And then I have a PT appointment. Uh, it's at 2.30, it's 12.30 right now. So I have a PT appointment in two hours. My first whatever. I haven't ever had a PT appointment before, but with like all my back stuff going on, I'm gonna start seeing a PT, Let's see if I can get that fixed. It's feeling a lot better after getting the injections. 
done. Um, I think I got them done about a week and a half ago. My back feels so much better, but like obviously those are gonna wear off at some point. So like I wanna fix the problem and the root cause. I feel so stuffed up and congested. I was gonna go to Shred 415 for their lunch hour. Um, it's like a 45 minute lunch class. Uh, my class pass, um, I had to upgrade my class pass to go and I didn't do that before the noon. Plus I don't think I could have made it. I'm like, I don't think I would have made it through Shred 415. Plus I shouldn't go because I'm sick. I keep thinking I'm better. Like yesterday I was feeling so much better and I thought I was better and then today I'm not. I'm glad I didn't sign up for it yesterday. I am on antibiotics, so I don't know if I said that. I think I did say that. I am on an antibiotics and they said that after starting, I shouldn't be contagious after the 24 hours. We built Leela this little fort and she's been going in and out of it. And then she's very um, concerned with what I'm wearing right now. I got sent this by Sun Sauna, I think. So this is what it looks like. I've just got like YouTube playing in the background, but Sun Home Saunas. So Sun Home Saunas sent me this. It's like red light, blue light therapy for your face. I feel so funny wearing this, but I'm trying it out and you just put it on. I have this little like remote you can put in your pocket and I'm just sitting on the couch while she plays in her little fort that we built while I'm waiting for this. I think I have it set for 10 minutes and so far we are four minutes in. I have six minutes left. It's now 1.20 and I have to leave for PT in a little bit. Can you guys see how messy our kitchen is? Um, but I'm gonna put Leela down at two for a nap and then hopefully she'll sleep long enough until my appointment's over and Joey will just watch the monitor while I'm gone. But I'm gonna make Leela and I. Do you want a peanut butter? Do you want peanut butter and jelly? You want a peanut butter sandwich? What do you think? Do you want one? We're just gonna eat a peanut butter and jelly sandwich <laughs> for lunch. Well, late lunch for me. I think she already snacked around when I was on my walk, she already ate some lunch with Joey, but I like to stuff her full before her nap and she'll nap longer. So we're gonna do that. I am honestly surprised that this is the first time I'm talking to you guys in my car in this vlog because I feel like we usually start every single vlog in the car and then most of the vlog is in my car. Anyways, I'm on my way to my physical therapy, physical therapy appointment. Guys, ugh, being pregnant, I can feel my rib cage. It's getting bigger. And all my bras are like starting to drive me nuts. They're like too t too tight around the rib cage. I just like want looser stuff. And I'm like regretting my bra choice at the moment. At the stop sign. This bra that I'm wearing though is like a Skims dupe from Amazon. And it's actually really good. I feel like it's very similar to the Skims. I wouldn't say it's exactly the same, but honestly, I, I wouldn't know the difference. I only know because I know, you know what I mean? So um, it's pretty good. If I can remember, I'll link it below. Off of Amazon, it's like way cheaper than the original bra too, which makes it even better. Anyways, I'm feeling a lot better overall. It's 2.20 now. I feel like I'm still really raspy. Sign. Like my Turn voice right is raspy. Turn Meadows Boulevard. I feel like my voice is really raspy still, but like I'm just feeling better than I did this morning when I woke up. So that's a good sign. It might've been me getting outside and going on a walk might have been very beneficial for me. I made myself some chocolate milk, which is kind of a funny thing to make. Hopefully my appointment goes well. I'm not really sure what to expect since I've never seen a PT before. But overall, I got the vibe, like nothing against chiropractors. Like I love going to the chiropractor, but I kind of got the vibe from my back doctor <laughs> that it wasn't really gonna do me much good to go to the chiropractor. It's just like a quick fix and it's temporary but it sounds like PT is like more long-term fix. So hopefully that will help. If anything, I'm excited to just get some exercises from them that I should do at home on my own. Cause if you didn't know, I am a personal trainer. So like I know how to make workouts. Like I know form, I know all those things for like working out. Sometimes, you know, when you do it yourself, it's hard to write a workout plan for yourself. It's like so much easier for somebody else. I don't know if it's because I'm lazy or what it is, but I just have a hard time writing a workout for myself. Okay, this is so random, but I brought this as a purse because I didn't have a purse when I was walking out of the door, but I had this little bag and I just wanted something easy to carry my vlogging camera in and keys and everything. So I just grabbed this. This is like definitely not a purse. It like goes inside of my Lululemon bag. Okay guys, we're out of our appointment. 
it's almost 3 30 right now joey's sending me like lists of baby names right now i can't even think about baby names like joey has so he's the one sending me names and i'm like i just can't think about it it like stresses me out i am horrible with names i'm super indecisive and I just have a very hard time with, like, even when we named Leela, like, we didn't have her name picked out when we were driving to the hospital and my water had broke. Yeah, it, I'm, like, so bad with names because I'm so indecisive. Anyways, he's sending me a bunch of names, but got out of my appointment and learned some good things. Some things that I can't say I'm shocked by, like, I feel like I kind of knew. So they, like, did a bunch of tests on me and found out my core is really weak which I knew that because I really have not worked out my core since honestly when I was pregnant with Leela I really didn't work it out and even after I was really bad about working out my core um, just because I didn't want to get diastasis recti or recti I don't I don't know how you say it but you know what I'm talking about the other thing though that I learned that I'm kind of shocked by is I have very weak glutes compared to my hamstrings my quads and my hip flexors. So she said I have very strong hip flexors, very weak glutes. So um, there, I have some glute exercises to do at home and some core exercises. And she wants to see me once a week. Um, I'll probably do that for a few weeks, but I don't think I'll like do it long term. Just once I get the exercises, I think I can kind of like do them at home and strengthen them. So that's all good knowledge to have. They gave me a little band for my workouts, for my exercises. And I probably have very strong hip flexors from cycling, to be honest. I feel like cycling gives you really strong hip flexors. Um, but a good workout for strengthening my glutes would be bar three. I love bar three workouts. I should go take some bar three workouts. <laughs> so maybe I'll get signed up for some of those over the next week or two. Um, if you haven't tried bar three, it's like I used to teach for bar three and I loved it. I love the workout. I think it's great. It's an amazing workout if you're pregnant, a new mom, postpartum, all of those things. It's amazing workouts for that, but it's also just an amazing workout in general. Okay, I actually don't even know when the last time I like vlogged was. I know it was a while ago, but I am making dinner. Joey's at CrossFit. It's currently 5.03 to be exact. And I was just on the on FaceTime with my grandparents and they were talking to Leela, but I'm making these. These are from Sam's Club. It's like chicken stuffed with broccoli and cheddar like cheddar I was gonna say cheese and then cheddar and it kind of came out together but cheddar and broccoli and like a cream and it tastes really good so I'm gonna bake these for 45 minutes so they'll be ready about when Joey gets home and then I'm also gonna make some rice and I make my rice in the instapot which is so easy I don't know if you know this but if you have an instapot it makes the best sticky rice and all you have to do, I put my rice in here. I put one cup of rice in here. I'll probably make two cups because Lila likes to eat it a couple days. Like we use it the next few days. So I put, you put one to one ratio, basically a cup of, of rice and then you'll run it under the tap, drain it, run it, drain it. And you kind of strain it until it, the water runs clear. So you're just like rinsing the rice. Sometimes I just run my fingers through and drain it. And then after that, you drain all the water out. Obviously there's still gonna be a little bit in the rice cause it's hard to get it all. Um, and then put it in and add a cup of water. So one to one ratio. I just hit the rice button on mine, which I think is 10 minutes. Not totally sure, Google that, but I just hit the rice button, let it cook. And then once it's done cooking, I let it slow vent for 10 minutes. And then after the 10 minutes, I release it and um, it's sticky rice and it tastes so good. Clean up your fork. Do you want to help me? Let's clean up your fork and put it away. Uh, Too long, but I don't 